not into all of the sugar that is involved in Halloween. I'm not the Grinch who stole Halloween for sure. All of the peanut butter cups belong to me and the uh, peppermint patties are mine as well. However, there is a limit to the amount of sugar that kids can take in. So I went to CVS, I did a last minute shop, and I wanna talk about some fun ways, inexpensive ways to celebrate Halloween that don't involve candy. So um, first of all, I love these gel things for the window. We live in an apartment and you can't, I don't wanna put a whole lot of stuff on the walls because my walls are really nice and I don't wanna put a lot of holes in the walls. So these gel things just stick right to the window and they're really cool and they come in all different holiday uh, assortments, but I love this. I'm actually gonna surprise the girls when they come home today. This is gonna be on the, wall, uh, the window in our kitchen. So super excited about that one. Um, next up, I bought two of these for the girls and I'm gonna swap out Halloween candy for these globes. So that's gonna be my trick that they give me their treats and in return they get, they love these snow globe things and this was on sale at TV, CVS, it was two for $5, that's pretty good. So I'm gonna say 20 pieces of candy and you get the snow globe. I think it's a pretty good trade um, for sure. And then other little goodies. So if you've got trick-or-treaters coming to your house, I had four great things I found in like the bargain bin. They had these two for $4 pens, these little Halloween pens. These are so cute. They had um, bouncing eyeballs. How awesome is this? So this was eight counts, two for $4. Pretty awesome. They had, uh, everybody remembers these from they were, when they were kids, the spider rings and bug rings. These are awesome. But these were 20 count, two for $4 steel and then they had um, erasers and these erasers and anytime you go to school they're all the rage the kids absolutely love these so this was 25 Halloween erasers this is one of them this is like the spooky green witch um, two for four dollars for the Halloween erasers so if you get a big bundle of this you might not even have to give Halloween candy and I know stickers were okay but this is a little bit cooler for big kids especially in the bouncy ball this is gonna be driving teachers crazy for weeks to come and then my last thing I found at CBS this was of course one of those merges. I didn't mean to go in there to get this. The other things were kind of on my list. But how cool are these? So when your kids are trick or treating, they can have these flashing lights when they go um, out on the street, and it might call a little bit of tension, a little bit of Halloween safety. And then it has the same the setting where it's just oh, there's flashing, and then this is the solid light. So this one, I don't remember, the, it was around two dollars also. So and this came in a bunch of different patterns and prints. So sugar-free Halloween, all from CVS. Easy ideas, inexpensive ideas, and your dentist will love you after the holiday. So last minute Halloween fun. There's more ideas over on momtrends.com. So be sure to swing by and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a single video.